What's going on, better ball players? Let's take a look at what bags they're currently offered in 2024 for your youth baseball player and all the way up to kind of the pro level as well. Let's take a look. So your son or daughter is looking for a bag to use for baseball or softball. So primarily you're going to see three types of bags. You're going to see that roller bag that has a handle kind of like a roller luggage, right? You have a backpack one that doesn't have wheels. It's basically just put it over the, you know, your back and act like as, as a backpack. And then you kind of have like the duffel ones where you hold it with a strap or anything like that, where it's basically just like a duffel bag and um, you carry it with, you know, usually with the strap and then two hands and you hold it by your side. You can throw it over your shoulder sometimes as well. So it's kind of the three bags that are currently available in 2024 that I see that are the most popular. So let's start with the most popular bag. You probably see it all over your travel ball leagues. All the teams have them. You see, you know, everywhere you go, the roller bag is number one by far. Obviously, the roller bag is by far the, the most popular because it helps those little kids, you know, roll the bag rather than having to carry a heavy bag. And, you know, they're able to transport it pretty easily, even though it can, you know, obviously have issues with wheels, handles and all that kind of stuff. So let's take a look at what we have to offer so far. So by far, the number one recommended bag I see all over everywhere is the Boomba bag. So as you can see here, they have various bags. Um, I'll, the most unique one obviously that i see all over is this the super pack rolling bag here so again i'm just on booba.com and i'm looking all over i'm not affiliated with boomba or anything but i my kid has one both my kids have one all my travel kids have one so it's just a, a very popular bag um so let's click on this and let's look at this so as you can see um they have all kinds of designs on here um, you can customize your own too. They have customiz customization options. Um, they have so many designs out there for every different colors and, and feel, look and feel. My son actually has this one. So as you can see, um, front pouch here that flips up. It has a Velcro thing for batting gloves right here. Another storage container right here. A shoe department down here. A bat sleeve here for that fits two bats. Um, a little storage pocket here. We like to put the water bottle in there. Another storage pocket here. Um, a little side bin here. Another bat sleeve here that can fit two bats. And up here, you can tie in your bat handles up here with the Velcro strap. Um, inside the bag, let's see if they have a picture of it. There's the back. This one actually comes with hooks so we can hook it on the fence. So right there is a good little feature. You can hook them all up, keep them off the ground for ants or in, and bugs as well. Um, you see the heavy-duty wheels there, and then the telescoping handle that comes in and out. Um, you know, another side look, side look there. Um, yeah, they don't have one inside. But inside, um, the top container, you know, with all the stuff in there, and then it has a, a little shelf to separate the feet department from the top department as well. And those come in, you know, at $115, bucks, uh, you know, all day. If you customize it, the price goes up. So that's that one. Um, let's take a look at the other options that they have. Obviously, I showed you those in the front thing. Obviously, they have the sim si similar type of one that does have no wheels there. So obviously, the difference there is it has no wheels. Um, they have a hybrid one that's kind of like a little bit smaller of a pack. Um, then they have a super pack XL. This would be for your catchers and stuff like that. Um, I would recommend that for your catchers. Obviously it fits a lot more in there, different, you know, containers and stuff like that, as you can see on the screen. And then like a mini one, which is more of a smaller backpack rather than the super backpack. Um, yeah. And then obviously the price points on this one, obviously it being the smallest one is only $60 and they have so many options there. And it comes with all the same type of features, just a little bit smaller in container, you know, container in, in the middle. So 
That was that. Let's show you some other options. Let's show um, you uh, back on Headbanger Sports here. So obviously there's some other options. This was kind of like the duffel bag, uh, the Evo Shield duffel that I'm talking about. It's pretty much not made to carry bats, but it can, in a pinch, it can be um, there. That comes at $100. Uh, they make a backpack as well with a bat sleeve on the side. Just, you know, another $100 there. Um, Rollins makes some options here. Um, obviously a lot less customization. Um, at $220, it's kind of a roller bag there. And then they make a backpack version. And then you have obviously some Micken ones there for your slow pitch type things. Easton, Di Marini has a backpack. Easton has a backpack. Easton, another backpack there. You can see the price points. Um, you'll see another wheeled bag here, the Micken one, and that can actually fit bats in the sleeve there. Um, this one is a Di Marini um, with the bat sleeves on the side. You can fit two on each side. Um, coaches, some coaching options. Obviously, there's a bat quiver, quiver right here from Marucci that you can put your bats in. The Di Marini uh, Special Ops right there is a huge bag. It comes in at $230. So, you know, a bat can, bat bat can get really expensive if you want it to. Um, there was also one... Um, Extra baseball bag. Uh, let me see the uh, no errors baseball bag. Another one that I've I've seen um, very popular is the no errors bag. So let's take a look here. I'll share this instead. So you can see this one. This one I've seen a lot of catchers with. Um, this is the No Errors bag. It's a, you know no no dash errors .com. They have a lot of color options in here, and it's also wheeled, and um, has a huge storage compartment. They actually have Fat Boy wheels. It's, it's another selling feature of that. Bunch of cool little features. There's some knobs right there that stay on the thing. And I've heard nothing but good reviews here, but you are paying a $300 price tag on that one. So, yeah, I mean, there's some options all day long for, you know, how customized that, you know, custom custom you want the bag. But you can also go standard colors and save yourself some money. But depends on the size and position of your son or daughter. So that kind of is a full tilt bag review in 2024. Um, pick what you want. If you're shopping Headbanger Sports, use code BDB to save on select items. And yeah, let me know what you guys are rocking. Obviously, the Boomba bag is what my kids are rocking currently. But let me know in the comments what you're rocking. And if there's other options that I missed, let me know in the comments as well. And uh, thanks for watching. Uh, we'll see you on the next one.